through the many gaming vehicles that have gained gaming notoriety, few have been as revered as the Warthog from the Halo. Being an Xbox-exclusive FPS game, it is little surprise that this futuristic military vehicle appears in the Xbox-exclusive racing series, Forza. However, despite Forza and Halo being as old as the original Xbox, it's quite strange to think that this rather easy cross-promotion between brands only occurred in 2016 when it was available to drive in Forza Horizon 3. But this is not without reason. Despite being playable in the series starting in 2016, the Warthog actually first appeared in a Forza game in 2011 in Forza Motorsport 4, but you could not drive it. Players were just teased by having it only available through Forza Vista, which is more or less a car gallery that allows ultra-detailed looks at cars gamers cannot afford. Out of the 600 plus cars that were available in Motorsport 4, this is the only one that's not drivable, and the reason is because the Warthog has four-wheel steering. Forza is a simulation racing game. All the physics are tied to a very realistic interpretation of how cars react in reality from the engine performance to the tires. Every other vehicle in this game is turned by the front wheels, as well as the vast majority of every car ever made. The Warthog has four-wheel steering, which although is not a revolutionary concept, is just incapable of being properly modeled in Forza Motorsport 4, or at least within the limitations of the physics engine the game was on. It may be a fictional vehicle, but an appearance in Forza would mean it would have had to be presented as though it were real. Since there was no Warthog that had normal steering, there was no way to create a realistic version of the Warthog as it appears in Halo. Until, of course, in Forza Horizon 3 where the Warthog has normal steering. Hmm, why is that? The official name of the Warthog that appears in all Halo games, and the one that appears in Motorsport 4 is called the <clears throat> ANG Transport Dynamics M12 Warthog FAV, whereas the one in Forza Horizon is called the ANG Transport Dynamics M12 S Warthog CST. Note the FAV versus CST nomenclature at the end there. FAV stands for Force Application Vehicle, whereas the CST stands for Civilian Sport Transport. If it wasn't already obvious, the Warthog in Forza is not the same Warthog in Halo games. What you drive in Forza is a civilian version of the military Warthog, much like how the Hummer H1 is a civilian version of the Humvee. Yes, and what I can only assume is Playground Games asking 343 Industries to expand the Halo lore so they don't have to make handling physics for a four-wheel steering vehicle. The only time this particular Warthog ever appears in a video game is within the Forza games. Now, to their credit, they perform a lot of lore expansion regarding this vehicle, explaining how it's supposed to be a streamlined, sportier, cheaper version of its military brethren, having two-wheel steering because it's cheaper as well as giving better stability at high speeds. They also say that the CST has a gasoline-powered twin-turbo V8 in the year 2554, very strange. Even more so that's strange because the 12 liter hydrogen powered engine in the military version apparently makes the exact same performance. Now, astute Halo nerds will say, but there was already a civilian warthog. It's in Halo 2 Forge mode and it looks like it's on financed wheels. And yes, this is true, but that still has four wheel steering. Forza devs needed to model a realistic interpretation of a warthog from the Halo universe to put in their realistic racing game. So, them and 343i must have worked together to make something up for that exact purpose. It took only 11 years for this to be achieved, but regardless, it is a rather unusual case of video game lore being expanded due to technical limitations rather than just wanting more money. So, the next time you drive the Warthog in Forza, think to yourself, 
wow, I don't care about anything that was just said because the Warthog is not actually very good in Forza games. Thank <laughs> you.